masters. Anyway, go, go on the defense. It's gonna be tomorrow here on the Mercy Chiaki on the Zarya. Saito on Zenyata Silver Cobalt. We'll play the Junkrat, but Ninja on the tank. Reinhardt and Turbulence here. We'll be playing the Tracer. I don't know whose uh, Smurf account this is, but it is what it is. Nihigir on the other hand. We'll be playing the Attack Zenyata. Papu Prince on the Tracer. Nihigi move. Wins. Gonna be on the Reinhardt. Hanguk on the Zarya. Calamitous on the Widowmaker. And Rayla, of course, on the Mercy. To the red team, gonna go. For the push and ready, Saito Ninja both to fall. Super Cobalt though, with the kill on to one, trying to work on to the Zenyatta. But now Super Cobalt in the bot spot gets a quick little beam to the face. Charge comes out, and the red team already going for the capture. Calamitous there gets a snipe on to Turbulence, wants to go for a snipe on to Chiaki. Now Saito bubble in the way. Oh, Calamitous gets the two more. Highlight by highlight na bayon na bayon. I'll even know. Highlight na bayon. Oh, we're gonna get our calamitous already. No, oh, just fuck it. I'm just fucking with him, and I'm, I just feel giddy today. That's for sure. It's like I feel a little excited. I feel, well, I feel a little positive, honestly, in the face of everything, in the face of people being little assholes. But Ninja though does get the charge there on to Papa Prince, but Calamitous with a big pick off on to Saito. You never want to play the Zenyatta against a Widowmaker of that caliber. Chiaki right now ready to grab the search, but getting torn apart here. Graviton comes out, there is going to be Shatter as well there from but Ninja before he dies. Silver Couple good switching to the Reaper, taking a lot of damage there, gets sniped top, gets taken down this time by Hanguk, and Yigir will pop the Transcendence just Going for the advance, but Papa Prince with the kill on the side to Turbulence really low. Has to get away. We haven't even enough from Chiaki. Gonna go for the contest at the last second. 99.5% here. And the Gravitan Surge comes out here from the Red Squad. So far, Chiaki really low. Tomorrow, right now, zipping around. Calamitous does get the pick off. Chiaki falls this time to Mimimu. Full pop connects, but the Reinhardt will save the line. The Earth Shire, though, is dodged by the Reaper. He's gonna be the red team taking a very, very fast capture here on Volskaya. And welcome, guys, to our scrims. And welcome to the community. Ah. Welcome to uh who's actually playing? Kalam to free, exactly. Uh welcome to Papa Prince, Mimi Mu, and Hanguk right now for joining as well as Turbulence. I forgot who's I don't know. Paninong Paninong Smurf Yung Turb <laughs> I just wanna talk with people today. I don't even wanna cast too much. I just wanna I just wanna Bagu play here. Yeah, I don't remember. Really distracting you. Oh, oh there. This is the romance between Calamitous and Rela once again. But it is what it is. If you guys do need help in uh joining the wildfire tournament, well the Bagu say sir. Oh, wow. Uh, if you guys do need help in joining the off road tournament, uh you know. Coach niya ako, by the way. What? What? Oof! Redux is a coach? <gasps> wow! <laughs> anyway, I'm just so distracted. No? Like, like, honestly, I am just way too distracted right now. Why is Paranoia not community mod? There we go. Have a, have a delicious old community mod on me. Paranoia. Eh, si Gian na lang kulang da. What? Okay, okay, cool. Let's look at my spray. Where is that? Oh, I got him all in the rin. Why am I talking to everyone in the lobby? I'm not even paying attention to the cast. So we have a fire right here from tomorrow. Chiyaki gonna be on the Diva site on the Zen. So we're couple on the Orisa. It's interesting. We're gonna have the Orisa. We're gonna have a fire. Not really the best pairing as of yet. But Ninja playing the Ana and Turbulence is on the Tracer. On the other hand, he's the gear with the Zenyata. Papa Prince on the Tracer. Mimu on the Orisa. Hanguk on the Roadhog. Calamitous with the kill already onto tomorrow. Gonna be on his Widowmaker and Rayla on the Mercy. So the defense so far gonna be out in front here for the red team Chiaki though gets a pick off on to power prince oh huge halt there but silver cobalt no follow up so far but even not the best follow up there to the Orisa is gonna be Chiaki though bursting the bubble there's gonna be a halt once again Hanguk gonna charge and Kalam is gonna hop up on top and it is gonna be the, the Widowmaker falling to the far this time Zenyata though applying so much pressure here from the side of the defense. Rayla going for a quick little battle. Mercy play, but gets kicked by Saito in the face instead. Babu Prince over the pick up off the Zenyata. Tomorrow flying up into the sky. 
Tikto being taken and the tracer will fall. So very, very simple cast right here. And looks like neither team knows how to play defense for today. Hmm. What is guys, what is defense? Who who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Sniper! Don't get caught! team gonna go out in front. Yaki gonna dive in. But I think with the self destruct Oh no, gets the mech! He gets the mech before he's even able to position himself accordingly. Calamitous using the conveyor belt, trying to play aggressively, but falls instead to the hand of side to Power Prince. Trading it over in the back line already with the kill onto Turbulence. Wants to get a few more kills, waiting for the med pack to come out. Oh, the baby diva's gonna come out, and it's gonna be a Power Prince and Chiaki deal dueling with each other. Discord Orb and Chiaki does get the mech back thanks to the killer onto the tracer. Gonna slam this though, popping the Infrasight once again. Good sleep start there from Baninja. The blue team might be able to push into this. Has an Ana Boost. Silver Combo though, really low. And Self Shock is gonna come out onto the side. Gets a kill onto Mimi Mu. The barrier going the one way instead. But more does fall. However, and Power Prince does get the Pulse Bomb onto the Bongo Drum. Nia Gear gonna charge in. Shinsen is in hand. Side to blow with a pickup onto one. Shinsen is available. Hang the full foot off the full hog. And Side to just glowing right now onto the point. Keeping the push alive here for the blue team. Team Pablo Prince is dancing around. Here comes Rayla. Mimi Mu putting the supercharge there off the point. Very, very smart there to just try and put it out, out of farmer's way. The Aries is just dueling this time. But Silver Cobalt will fall instead. It looks like the blue team has to regroup. Sadly, they are at a disadvantage right now in terms of time. And for the red team, they're gonna, they're holding very well onto the defense thanks to the Orisa and thanks to Calamitous going for those picks as per usual. On the other hand, the blue squad will have to contend with playing the fire here against the Widowmaker tomorrow's specialty. But sometimes, even though it is your specialty, the matchup isn't the per isn't the best one to deal with. And look at Calamitous already with the pick off onto the Ninja. The Widowmaker out in front looking for a few picks. Side the really low falls to the hand of the Widow. Post bomb comes out. The Tracer gonna flick around as much as he can. Infrasight is available tomorrow with a kill on two of the one. The Rocket Barrage is uh, is ready here for the blue team. Infrasight now has been popped. Calamitous pop seeing the seeing past two walls right now looking for a target or two wants to go for the tracer of turbulence oh misses the shot there on to baninja here comes the hold from silver cobalt and there is gonna be a dash in from the tanks chiaki right now looking for a few more targets tomorrow ready with the rocket barrage and here comes the hamster ball coming at him oh tomorrow oh what happened tomorrow might have dc'd right there supercharger is available pop princess Flanking around, just going for those blinks. Gonna go for the recall. Shiyaki though glowing right now with the Nana Boost. Can be can get himself a shock in just a bit if he stays alive and gets those hits. But now Chiaki really low. Gonna hop up on top and doesn't use the self shock there to go for the reset. In the meantime, Nigir getting some free hits with the Zinyat. The baby diva just taunting, but will fall instead to the hand of the Widowmaker. The red squad right now filling up the kill feed with their names and filling up with the kill feed with the bodies of the blue squad their defense so far has been absolutely solid with Papa Prince right now causing so much chaos in the back line once again gonna go for the recall and both, both Papa Prince and Turbulence low level so okay okay uh, it's kind of questionable and I'm just going to hop up out to the back side of the kill on to Rayla already. The Mercy being caught out. Not being saved by the Widowmaker as well. Two ultimates ready. Chiaki going to go for the self-destruct in a very awkward spot. And Simba Kobo now switching to the Reinhardt instead. Being bullied around by Hangook. Terminus though. Let's get a pick off onto one. Fire Strike comes out. And here is the Valkyrie from Rayla. Spotting out Timora. The fire will be in the bot spot. Gets the scored up. Gets taken down. A quick little snipe there from Calamitous and the Valkyrie. Just keeping the red squad alive in this push. Hangok wants to go in with the Doomfist. Calamitous with a pick off onto one. And here comes the Doomfist. Just causing so much damage in the back line. What's up, Dom? How you doing? Calamitous right now. Just looking for a few more picks here and there. Silver Cobalt though, gonna go for the dash in. Tomorrow right now, ready for the Rocket Barrage. Side of the kill on to Hangook so far. And the blue team gonna go for the push as much as they can. Four ultimates ready here for... Oh, it's just three. Three ultimates ready here for the red squad. On the other hand, blue team does have two. And Beninja working on that back. It from in the back line. Doesn't get much. Turbulence is trying to work on the... Working on a pick as well, but it's gonna be take, they're gonna take down Pablo Prince at least taking care of that really annoying fly in the back line. Hango 
Rahat Punch into the Diva. We just like lands onto the tanks as well. And Super Gobble is the first fall. So Bishop now coming at the second floor. Gets absolutely nothing but the barrier. And Rahat Punch there from Timora aiming at the Rayla. But the defense matrix from Tiaki keeping Timora alive. And the blue team right now finally trying to get the first stick here on to the second point of. <laughs> what is that? Second point of Volskaya. I thought I saw Silver Cobble just spin around with the Reinhardt. That was amusing. Lucian on for Nia gear. Here comes a charge. Clamp still does get the pick off. No one on the point here for the blue squad. So they're not even able to get the first tick. The Earth Shatter is wasted there by Silver Cobble. Chiaki now gets the mech out. The tracer of the Rillets gonna pop out. And here comes Hanzo holding onto the charge. It's absolutely nothing so far. A minute and 30 seconds remaining here for the blue squad in their attack. And here comes Papa Prince once again, playing so aggressively. Tosses out the bosom though to the floor. Omega Lil, sup Infernal Combustion. The radar just has the Valkyrie. Can actually keep the defense strong with the chain healing. Of course, can use the damage was there too. Kalam as well. Just keeping it on the Widowmaker, just going for the pocket. And now Timora will be the target of the Valkyrie wielding pistol hero. That is Rayla. The fire caught out in the middle, gets taken down. Hangul though does fall, gets caught out as playing the Doomfist using the corner at now to go for the rest. Very smart position there from Rayla. Supercharger now being put up and being moved on the point. Just takes care of Chiyahi. Look at that. All those fusion cast shots to connect onto the baby diva. And Eager does get the sound wave kill for the time being. The red squad. Just waiting on for the last attack here from the blue team. And they even get the stagger on to Turbulence. But Ninja though, did bump the Valkyrie. Maybe she can get a kill or two. Demora is being supported, however, here by Ninja. Oh, Nihigir gets a quick little direct hit. That was absolutely critical there. If they got the kill. And Rayla falls down. Good job, Rayla. Now we have a Winston here from Silver Cobalt. Gonna be a full dive go up. Demora though being targeted by Calamitous. But it's this time the fire gain the kill. Chiaki with the self shock right now. On to the point. Gets absolutely nothing once again besides the buyer. Nia here ready with the sound buyer. Just waiting for her, his team to come back up in full. Could have been a lot earlier actually with the sound buyer. And here comes Rayla as well. Can Rayla go for the rest? Calamitous though does get a pick up on to one. On to two. This time holding on to the defense. Wants to go for Saito now but misses the shot there. On the Zinyata just floating around. But no contest so far here from the blue squad. Turbulence out in front. Kalamas trying to stay alive inside the right now. Gonna go for the transcendence. Doesn't want to get rocket punched. It is turbulence with the kill so far. And it, the wins in right now just going for the swings as much as they can. Tracer comes out. Oh, Hanguk does take down the Zinyata. And that is a critical pick there from the red squad. Gets ready with the healer. But Ninja though might be able to get back into the fight. Rocket punch in the back line. Can the blue squad make it? No, they can't. This is the red team. Solid defense on the second floor. And. I love the name already. I love the name of the team. Play of the game. Who's in? Who's in? Who's in? Uh, stream right now. Oh yeah, it's in. Nice. Don't snipe me, me. Three, huh. two, one. We are easy to in Didn't say you guys were together, Lama. I would uh, put put y'all on the same team. Anyway, gonna be Redux here. Gonna be playing the Widowmaker things on the Ana. Dumbledore, we hate each other, okay? The Arisa, we are for Dumbledore, just taking care of our XO. Leo, he's gonna be playing the McCree, Saito on the Zenyatta, and RxO gonna be on the Bastion. Well, gets it torn apart there by Nigir already. Nigir just tosses a few more right clicks here and there. Papa Prince on the Hanzo, gonna go for the flank, but takes a few face full of huge cannon shots right there. Nimu gonna be on the Ana, Hango on the Winston, Kalam is dead on the McCree, and Rayla on the Mercy, not going for the res. And the red team still winning this out without their DPS. Not enough damage coming out from the blue squad so far. The Bastion not really working out in their favor. They got sniped up. They got taken out. And now Papa Prince up on top. Redux looking for a pick or two. Gets a kill on the other BB move. But the first checkpoint uncontested. So the blue team, everything is all for naught. RX Odo out in front, whittling down the Winston. Just absolutely devastating there for Hango. Not really the best time there for the Winston. When you jump up in front of the, <laughs> of the Bastion. Calamus though will be able to shut this down apparently. You can flashbang a robot. 
but the red team gonna start pushing past the tunnel for the time being a very very easy push in from the red squad so far that's things coming out for, for now and Diggs gets a headshot and he's dead comes inside calamitous gets two gets three the dead eye is available here will get the kill there on to dumbledore hulk comes out and that's four absolutely impressive headshots there from kalam highlight na ba <laughs> Uh, gonna ask yung highlight na ba yan? Ang tagal ko. <laughs> Ay, nako, Kalamitos. Try harding so hard to be the highlight. What the guy? Oh, gets a sleep card instead from Dinks. Mas, high mas highlight pa yung sleep card. Nano Boost now is available. And here we go. Dumbledore Supercharger and Nano Boost at the same time. Here comes the Dead Eye. There's gonna be a bubble. Boost Squad, no, not going for the contest. They finally they do so. Leo with a pick up on to one And the payload finally being stopped. Huge by grenade there from Dings. Gets to need you. They'll stay alive. And Poppers with a kill. And the Gravity Surge comes outside the force to use the descendants. But they're not getting the contest. And the red team at the end. Still able to clutch that out. Tang ina. Well played there from me here. Rx Lex now being charged. RxO gonna go out in front once again. Really needs some assistance. Might not might want to change out the Orisa. Go for the Reinhardt instead. Might want to change out the Bastion. That's for sure. Doesn't hasn't really worked out so far in this game. Calamitous with a shutdown already on to Leo. Looks like you're not, we're not gonna hear him roar this time. Redux forced to back off as the Winston going for the dive in. Diana of things to go for a little toss out and is gonna be the Winston going for a few swings as El Calamitous and Power Prince with a pick up on to two. And oh, oh, okay, uh, no one saw that. We were not on things for that whole time. Not getting the hits on the Miyumu at all, but Eager will take that in the red squad. Just going for the push. Dumbledore right now switching to the Diva, but 100 energy is absolutely night night here for the, the Diva. Gets taken down so so quickly. No worry, things. No one saw that. What's happening to you? Yeah, the blue squad already losing losing a lot of space. The red team just trying their best to dive inside. Here comes Dumbledore, gonna go for the contest, gets taken down, the Lamps with the kill on to one, the red squad right now, getting the push all the way to the end. Very very easy right there for the red squad, Calamitous once again, just solid play, and honestly the whole red squad, very very efficient, Nigir with that Zarya, and Mimimu and, uh, what do you call Mimimu and Hanguk have been absolutely sub uh, sublime as well. So shout outs there once again to Mimi Mu, Hango Papu Prince, RxO, Leo. Thank you guys for joining our little little, little community scrims and I hope you guys do enjoy your time here. Gonna be Redux though. We're gonna be on the Widowmaker for the time being. We'll see Saito on the Zenyata as well. So the Red Squad right now, gonna their defense should be pretty much what they are actually ran. Maybe a Widow will be good as well. The blue team looks like they're practicing a little. Dings and Saito practicing a little, going for a quick little off roll. On the other hand, the red team, uh, it looks like they're playing their more standard roles. Basta kung kulang, may mga kulang pabukas after Reg and may, may pa post up. Stop for tomorrow. For tomorrow, guys. I say I want registration to end by tomorrow already, but like last minute ones, I'll try to fix up. I'll try to fix up a few teams as well, so we can have a, like eight teams, that kind of thing. And it is what it is. So I hope we see some more participants here, some more made teams for the the tournament. On the other hand, maybe the, Once the maybe the community starts, not really as no interested in up. playing uh, tournaments in the first place. Uh, who knows? Who knows? I don't really mind anymore. Uh, the blue squad right now gonna be on the attack. We will see a reaper here. We will see a widowmaker, and we will see a boofist as well. Not really the. <coughs> the most common things and Redux though is able to get a pick off on to Calamitous already. The blue team gonna go for the push for the time being. Just they pick up their on to Calam. Finally giving the blue team the opportunity to be uncontested. But it's gonna be Papa Prince sleep card as well and Dix. Thank you. So it's Redux who gets a headshot. I mean it's not even a headshot. Just a side, it's like a shoulder shot. But that takes care of Papa Prince RxO just floating around with the raid form. It's 
Calamitous right now back into the fight going trying to go for a snipe there on to Leo and here comes the Mercy always trying to go for the pocket and RXO out in front bubble there and Calamitous gets the reaction shot that the we have Dumbledore though on Zarya, so the blue squad should probably switch out one of their DPS players into a tank instead. Trying to test against this Reinhardt. Good charge right there from Hangul. Takes care of Redux in the red team right now. Can he kill onto 3 Tom just standing there and he knows he's dead. He knows he's absolutely foobar right there. Calamus with a pick up now on to things. Infrasight is available. Redux winning. Winning. He's winning this. Uh, 1v1 with a maker battle and that's been the story of the 1v1s here between two snipers. Calamus though does have the inner side popping it. One thing the first thought. Calamus able to get a kill Saito right now, just floating around. Gonna be on the Zenyata. RXO on the Brigitte. It's actually a lot better than going for a third DPS. Brigitte is a solid, solid addition to any team. Just gonna charge in, go for the shield bash, and just hope for the best and expect the worst. Shield bash connects onto a bubble. Redux has won again against Calamitous, but Rayla, of course, just holding her baby boy in her arms. Just resting Calamitous back up. Good shadow right there from the Reinhardt of Hangook, but takes a sleep dart instead. And Redux right now. Oh, Rayla finally gets revenge there for Calamitous. Finally, need. Yo mercy pa nanalo sa sa dul no windows. What what a guy. <laughs> the trash talk. I don't know why. I feel so trash talky to Callum today. Lam just no <laughs> busy typing. <laughs> Oh, not so oh, guy. But anyway, the blue squad right now finally makes an opening. They get a pick up on to two. Calamitous still gets a snipe there on to the blue face. And Rayla putting Powerful Prince back into action. Digger falls down. And it's gonna be a, cool, a transcendence right now here from the blue squad. So they're gonna use this to push in. The Nana boost is available as well. The Mercy now losing the Valkyrie. Gonna start falling down back to the ground. And here's the Zarya out in front. Rayla falls there to the hand of Dumbledore. And this has been a proper switch here from the blue squad. The Reinhardt of Hango is trying to get away from the door it's like stop taking me stop trying to hurt me but it's gonna be rx oh instead with the stun redux once again winning the duel and calamitous what are you doing today my friend not uh, not on point as all here comes papa prince but finally the blue squad does get the first capture of their their first point here on route 66 the blue team right now with another set of pickoffs and they're gonna push into the tunnel once again. We have the Reinhardt of Hangul just hopping around. Calamitous ready with the Infrasight in just a bit. Three ultimates ready here for the blue squad so far. They're gonna go for the flank. Two right clicks here and there. Gonna be Saito charging it up as well. Redux! Redux. Dude. How many times are you gonna get the kill there on to Calamitous? That is the real question so far. Gonna be a charge in right now and Neo up in the sky. Gonna go for the meme strike there on the meme move, but transcendence on point, keeping the Zenyatta alive. The Red Squad though should use it to go for the advanced play. And it's gonna be power for the with a kill onto things, get stuck at the electrical board. Gets taken down. Leo with the pick off there, just getting the rocket punch and now in the back line looking for a target or two. Spy 6 spam now onto the floor and Mimi Movie really low falls down this time. Re Redux does have the Infrasight available and the Red Squad gonna be using Hangul to just try and establish a foot. But it's not working out so far. Charge to connect. Leo does get the punch out, and it's gonna be Goofus winning this out, albeit barely. The blue squad with another set of picks, and they are reaching to go into the second checkpoint so far. Where is that going? Where did that camera go? In, uh, in okay. Hmm. So no contest so far, Mimimu switching to the Lucio, trying her best to just dance around the payload, but instead gets a quick little discord orb and a ball to the face. Saito right now with the pick off and info Saito right now from both squad. Leo falls, Graviton Surge comes out from Dumbledore, but is there gonna be any follow-up? Finally, Saito with a kill on to one, but that's not gonna be enough, because Dumbledore is going way too advanced there, but way too far from his team. They do get two in that exchange, but here comes the Shatter right now from Hangul, putting to the floor. Good side there from Redux once again. Rayla advancing into the Widowmaker and the Zenyatta, and here's the rally now. RxO keeping everyone alive. Thanks with the pick up on to one, and here comes the mace to the face. Mimu falls to the hand of Redux. Calamitous with the counter snipe, and the Graviton Surge. Finally, Calamitous getting those headshots when everyone isn't moving at all. So the Red Squad right now with a pick up on to two. RxO gonna dive in. Whipshot is available there. Whipshot rather you on to me here so far. 
And Hangook right now is gonna be on the hamster ball instead. Red Squad gonna go for the push. Oh, Calamitous with a snipe there onto RXO. Snipe onto Redux as well, who was just uh, crouching around. Thinks those sleep dart connects. Calamitous dies. Really good fire grenade right there. But now it's gonna be the hamster ball going for the swings. Hangook gets the boop and si things will fall to the hand of the Lucio instead. So now the Red Squad going for a solid, solid defense. It's gonna be Leo though. Oh, gets a slam there on the Mew with the the meter strike connects onto the Lucio, but for now it's the sniper duel that is the one you have to keep an eye out on. Redux and Calamus know exactly where each other are, and just waiting for an opportunity to get each other's head. Back. Once again in the back line, here's gonna be a dive there from me. You're trying to shock the Widow Maker as much as you can. Oh, the Wrecking Ball does get two with the grappling hook, just pulls in, takes on Arxo, and Dings looks like you're not now. Laps at the Mr. G and OMG. Is that an admin of Warang memes? What a guy. My, uh, Mr. Pilo. Mr. Pilo, I don't feel so good. <laughs> Allowance though, not making anyone's life feel good at all. This was Widowmaker has been absolutely impressive with the sidelines. Finally, the crouch game. The crouch game is real there for Redux. Finally, he gets the shot. <laughs> oh my god. Sleep Dart now connects there from things. It's easy to get the headshot there on the Sleep Dart there on to the Wrecking Ball. Calamitous with the kill on to 3. So far, solid flank so far. And the red team right now is going for the no advance. Inversight now comes out. It's gonna be a sound buyer though from Mimimo. So Graviton Surge though in response from Numpledore. The red squad out all the way out in front. The blue team already struggling to get back inside. The rally is available here. You get the thunder on to Mimimo. The Lucian side just came around, but the Brigitte will get the kill. And here's the rally in front of the hamster. The, the primal rage though from Nigir trying to keep everyone out in about. OMG. The nano boost now is there, and Mimimu switching to the Symmetra. We'll see if this actually works out as RxO and Calamitous are both glowing. No, Redux gets the headshot once again, just shutting this down. The blue squad right now just gonna go for the push. It's the media insight available here for Redux right now. The hang really low does fall after the stun there from the Brigitte. And now the payload is gonna be the contesting point. It's gonna be the Wizard caught out, and the gear falls so so easily. The Symmetra going for the right clicks, gets a sleep dart in response. Really going for the heal, and there's the teleporter onto the conveyor belt. The Doof is all the way in the back line, gets a kill onto Calamus with some help there from Redux. The transcendence is there as well. The blue team in their last effort looks like it's being successful so far as Hangook has to retreat the Discord is on him and the Winston just hopping around Nigir falls to the hand of Nyx and the blue squad out in front gonna be a right quick succession there from the Zenyatta no contest so far can the red team make it no they can't the blue squad gonna finish the map as well Uh, it's gonna be a minute here for the blue squad on the other hand the red team 514 uh yeah Murang memes assemble <laughs> new team new team incoming the Murang memes team we'll see if they actually show up uh, show out in time or <laughs> please even maximum effort over here okay dude it's okay but see try and it's up to you how much you want to try in the first place. Who is Tekatokun? Tekatokun, who are you? Please speak up if you're in the chat. I guess I'll just... I'll give you an ad anyway. In I don't know who seconds. to get rid of though. All my friends, list. I'll get rid of them. Mm. It's like... It's like sometimes... I, I'm friends with them naman in real life, but it's not the same. You know, it is what it is. Once again guys, please 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 check out the tournament, it's gonna be wildfire on the weekend. So if you guys do wanna join for a 21k prize pool, gonna be gonna be something to watch. You know, something Five, to enjoy four, as well. If you wanna support three, the stream, smash that follow, smash that sub, you know, those kind of things. And things in Dumbledore are not really picking yet, finally we see some switches. And it's gonna be Symmetra here for the Red Squad. We'll see if the Symmetra pick will actually work out within this one minute defense. So right click now, come on, Redux though does get a pick off on to Calamitous. Redux kicks out Hangook as well. What are they doing there? Just standing still. So Redux right now able to just dive in once again. Fire Strike comes out there from Nii Gear. Teleporter just going for some faffing phrase and the sentry turrets just out and about by the rocks. Leo though misses a jump, so the Winston right now 
not channeling his inner gorilla, there's gonna be a lion instead. Here we are. I don't know, Lannister sent their guards and fucked their brothers and sisters or some shit like that. But it's gonna be Gorilla trying to get away. Papa Prince with a kill on two and Calamus gets a pick off of the jumping Winston. RXO right now losing the shield. Oh, sleep that connects from things on two. D, Junkrat, and by grenade, Kobe's his way to victory. Now gonna be the two snipers dueling once again. Calamus versus Dings, but Dings has to go for the contest or there's gonna be the end of the round. As ah, unfortunate, unfortunate right there. Score three to three. Patay na dapat. could have been a kill, honestly. That could have been a kill, but it's not. So, yun talaga minsan ng life. Ang buhay, parang life. Yeah, that fun. Uh, but we both have a very one shot. We won't have a very long uh, uh, scrim session today. Oh. The huge, huge, huge GM Mercy main commentary by Rayla. What a girl. What a gal, this gal. Rayla. <laughs> what well, a Saksangan oras kay laro. Uh, usually, good. Ang, ang sagot ay good question. But, but today, maybe before 10 and nothing. <laughs> usually, I. <laughs> good question equals ride all you can by the EK. <laughs> But uh, it is what it is. Sometimes I have to go out today, guys. I have somewhere to go to. Me skids uh page ko naman. Anyway, let me read off right now getting the Venomine trigger. Uh the com slash Oh, I gotta plug real quick on my own lock. What a guy. Gonna be things on Diana as well. Double door right now. Soldiers of six shooting down Papa Prince with Calamitous with the pick off. Leo gonna be on the Winston. Saito on the Zenyata and RXO is gonna be on the Diva. So this falls to Red Squad right now. They're still running this Cobra. Mimi Moo right now just trolling her way to victory with the builders and the turret. Just doing a lot of damage into the back. What a Torbjorn main is Carolyn. Tor Torb main, Torb god. <laughs> Look at this, the turret now being built once again. And the Orisa Barrier actually gets in a perfect direction. Saito though gonna dive in, takes down Mimi Mu. Rx is gonna come back into the fight. Kinabu Squad actually make it, things just hopping around. He knows it's not gonna be enough. Okay, the red team will take the win. <laughs> okay, that was fun. <laughs> oh, that was something. That's for sure. That's, that was something. Play of the game. Okay, who gets put the Oh the the headshot from <laughs> headshots there. Don't put me in Muna. Okay, yes Timora. Of course I will not uh game. Gabi Chiang here on the Reinhardt Supercombo. Gabi on the Lucio are so gonna be the Symmetra Mimi Mu on Diana Hanguk on the Zarya and Rela is on the main. On the other hand, he is near here with the Ryan, Papa Prince on the Han, so I gog on the Zarya, Leo on the Lucio, Baninja on the Mercy, and Calamitous on the Widowmaker. Oh, Calamus already getting the first pick off on Surreal first. Oh no, that is absolutely uh, dreadful to Calamus' personal life. But very good for this game because Calamus does get a pick off on the Silver Cup as well. Coming for these are right now of Hanguk. RxO with the Symmetra. Oh, the teleporter being put up, but it's way too late. The Symmetra is already dead. So the Blue Squad right now losing out on the point already. The red team right now getting the first tick so far. The question is can the Blue Squad actually contest this? Surreal with the pick off on to Niigir. Getting a speed boost there from Silver Cobalt, and here comes the Lucia. Perfect sign there from Calamitous. Doesn't get the instantaneous kill, however. And the red squad right now all over the point, as well as the blue team trying to go for the defense. Hanguk with the kill, and Jiaki now gets Nana boosted up by Mimu. Hanguk with the second kill. Rayla takes down Calamitous as well. So 1 1 now is the score between the May and the Widowmaker. So the red team gets beaten back after the first tick. I don't mind trying to make so much drama between Rayla and uh, Calamitous, but <laughs> I don't even know. Let's do it. 
But now Calamitous does get a pick off on to Silver Cobalt and the Red Team gonna go for the push. Huge grab there from Hanguk. And now the blue team getting a few more picks. Shiaki with the charge and Sapphire that comes out from Leia, but it's a little too late to actually go for the save there onto the two tanks. So Red Team will use it to retreat. Calamitous does get a pick up on to one. Dragon Strike is popped up as well. But now it's gonna be a blizzard there from Rayla. Gets a kill there onto Igog. The blue squad right now with the pick up on to two. And the red team with the first tick so far. Mimi Mu right now going for some healing as well. And now Calamitous. This gets taken down there by Hanguk. The Symmetra gonna come back into the fight. Has the Photon Barrier available in his arsenal. On the other hand, the Grab and the Valkyrie are out and about here for the Red Squad as well as the Infrasight here from Calamitous. So for the, for the Red Team, they have been stalled here by the two tanks. We have a Valkyrie right now here from Baninja. And the Infrasight is there as well to allow the Red Team to see exactly where the Blue Team is. Photon Barrier though is out in the path. While you can't see, you can see through that wall, you can't shoot past it. And that is the perfect counter there to the Infrasight from RX. So Symmetra Turrets also takes care of the Gear Calamitous though. With a pick off on to Realist. That's 2-1 two, two, this time. Now the boost is available here for the Blue Squad. And what the Red Team is doing, they're going for the rotation. Look at where Calamitous is going. Look at this. Look at this guy just already waiting for the pickoff. In the meantime, the blue squad and the red squad out in front. Will we see a clash here? No calamitous. Now completely useless. Sunfire is popped. And the blue squad getting caught in by the Graviton Surge. But I got right now keeping everyone keeping the bubble. Near here alive, holding on to the Earth Shatter as well here for the Red Dragon Heart. And now Chiyaki is gonna be glowing. The Earth Shatter is available here for Chiyaki as well. And the Speed Boost is there to take care of the Ninja. Chiyaki now with the kill onto two. The Lamb to the kill onto Rayla once again. Three is to one. Arx oh, oh, out in front and the Symmetra putting up the turrets is melting calamitous. And it's gonna be the blue squad holding on to this once again. Spawn camp. Oh, you guys are so special. Uh, the the real the real clash between here is the real Calamitous one, and everyone else is a a wonderful side attraction. That's for sure. But the blue team honestly has been so so superior in their defense. Just camp play has been solid as well as Diana has been pretty sublime actually. You know, there's gonna be an ice wall right there and the Symmetra turrets are out and about as well. The red team right now getting the poop and oh the shatter comes out from Chiaki. Valkyrie popped out now by Baninja. He has to go for the contest. Two to one trade so far. Calamitous looking for a few more targets but the photon buyer out in front. Dragon Strike comes out there from Papu Prince. Uh, Chiaki up on the point putting up the shield but doesn't do some anything against the Dragon Strike and now the Nanimus is there. Chiaki going for a few swings. Nigir is really low. Falls to the hand of Chiaki. Chiaki with the kill all to do charge in right now the Lucio gets booped up and the blue squad staying on to the point for the time being the earth shatter is available and look at that hippity hop Leo finally gets stunned up onto the teleporter gets taken down two kills so far here for the blue squad and it's gonna be Rayla putting the ice age onto the point the blue squad gonna hold this and wow this is redux putting points when it shouldn't be what a guy this guy Actually, no, the, man, the spawn camp doesn't count. <laughs> Yay, we are there. Yeah, the blue squad right now has been absolutely solid in their defense. It, it also, I, I would actually blame uh, the Widowmaker for not uh, trying. Oof. Oof. But I'm just carried last game for, for always carried. Always carried. Rayla, Rayla always carries Calamitous. Dodge carried Calam 2GM, 2GM, Omega Lul. Dodge carried 2GM. Oh, I'm carry Calam. Boost. <laughs> I am this. Omega Lul. Boosted. Boosted. Boosted with Domain. I paid Dodge exactly. <laughs> But <laughs> ni balik tade. Easy clap. Chain shot man. Attackers incoming in May vote naman eh. The government has a mamania baby. We just, just send the clip to dodge all the way in Korea. Jo dodge this off Korea by the way. So miss kana namin El Capitan. But it is what it is. So hopefully. Hello. I am MK people. PM scream nyo. So yeah, this is what it is. So 
Red Squad is going to be running a <laughs> Zarya on the Gear Pop Prince on the McQueen. Aiga on the Reinhardt. Leo is going to be on the Moira Baninja on the Lucio and Calamitous on the Widowmaker. Gets a fake hip already on to Hanguk. RX all going to be on the Bastion. Mimi Mu on the Symmetra as well. And look at that. The turrets just don't so work so far. So the Red Squad though. Let's try to keep on to the point, but Rayla with a pick up on to Power Prince. Can put up the ice wall. Nope, just drops down instead. Gonna try to go to the flank. It's gonna be absolutely incredible if she, she can get the kill on to the widow. Oh, the boop! The boop for the Grayla back onto exactly the platform where Calamity is gonna be. That would have been absolutely terrible there from Maninja if Rayla got the kill onto the Widowmaker because of that. The ice block now is available here, and RX would actually fall, so the Bastion not really working out so far. The blue squad with a very, very interesting lineup. They have the Sim, they have the Mei, and they have the Bastion Coalescence now comes out from Leia. Just trying to whittle down, the, ch the Chatter comes out, and Aya now with the kill, and it's Calamitous taking people out left and right. Solid shot there right there from Igog to allow the red team to just dive into the bus area. The red squad right now holding on to this, gonna you know, back off back to the point instead. And hopefully we actually got the replay of that. Oh yeah, there's the shatter right there, putting down three ice walls there from Rayla to try and attempt a save. The Bastion gets taken down by the uh Makri as well. So for now the red squad just holding on to the spence, gonna go for the charge into the movie theater and Hango gets taken off down there by Calamitous, the headshot perfectly on point right now, turrets come out, oh the snipe there, onto the turret as it comes out, and Rayla gonna go for the freeze, will he get the freeze there on to the Reinhardt, no, but it's Nigir falling instead, RxO right now, configuration tank is out, Sabire is there as well from the blue squad so far, Hango pointing that hand right there with the coalescence, and RxO bastioning it up, Sabire perfectly played there by Baninja to save Igong, good thrust right there from the Reinhardt to... Sorry about the technical issues right there. Ooh. Play of the game. to notice that as well gonna be on uh Li Jiang tower first and foremost gonna start things off here on uh night market Just looking for looking for something real quick so gonna be tomorrow on the reaper and silver cobalt on the lucio so they're gonna go straight for the point really gonna be on me as well Yimu on the, the moira farfakan on the reinhardt and chiaki on the zaya but it won the other hand oh the boop the boop there from silver cobalt gets to spotting outside the end redux the red team right now okay bye to the zarya as well silver cobalt with the kill on the three okay that's highlight worthy right there Exactly what you do on night market, exactly what you have to do to just keep everyone off the point. That's that's for sure what you in the first one. Daxi Waxi Duck Squad. It's 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 the best. It's the best. So hopefully we have a new name for our little fan club. Nah. I'll I'll make a group. <laughs> Should I make a group? This is just for trolling. I don't even know anymore. Mimi Mudo just trying to heal up as much as she can as well, keeping everyone topped up for the time being. Sadikam being set up as well. So for now, the blue squad just waiting on for the red team to actually advance in. Chaos Cruiser and Timora right now, both on the Reaper side, the tossing a few more balls the way onto the point. And the blue squad, they go for the amp it up. Super Kobo playing very aggressively. Can't get punished so, so easily right here. Cool. Essence out comes out here from Mimi Mu. 
I was Ice Wall is placed up, and Simara with the pick up on the KS Cruiser, Double Dar, and Redux so far. Saida gets taken down as well. Chiaki right now, really, really low. The blue squad will kill on to five, and it's gonna be the blue team just trying, just running over Hangul. I should update MMK. 8.45. Na scream nyo. I won't give for Matt and MMK. There you go. I need Axe Spoke Jam. What a guy this Lev. But in the meantime, the red team just holding up on uh, all their ultimates as much as they can. The nano boost is available. And now Dumbledore just trying to be out in front. The more looking up in the sky for some reason. What is he actually looking for? That is the real question. Chiaka ready with the Grafton Surge. The red team though struggling to actually advance onto the point. Nano boost is available here for Nyx. Timora comes out once again. Death Blossom is available. And here comes the Beyblade after the Grafton Surge. No, she's not gonna use it. There'll be a charge instead from the Reinhardt of Fire Falcon. Bring Saito to the Abyss. The Blue Swan going for a few swings. Gonna be the blue team though, keeping on, keeping on with this defense. 98% and counting, and the blue squad will be taking it 100 to 0. I'm screaming, what face? <laughs> Imi Mu is hacking. Ah, okay. Moira, Moira hacks. Goddamn. God damn, Moira yeah, hacks right there, dude. That is like the best kind of hacks. I have grabbed an enemy team. <laughs> Lev, uh, I love, I love how your eff I love the effort, Lev, dude. I love, I appreciate. So we might see a symmetry this time for control center. Gonna be Rayla on the May once again. Blue Squad actually, it's it's women and children. Literally, it's women and children right here. Simon's no, no Simon's kind of kid. I know he's, he's my baby boy. But Samora, Rayla, and Mimi Mu, the girl squad with the Chiaki Silver Goblet and Farfak and child squad, and now Dinks. Just taking down Timora right now. I don't want to make any domestic violence jokes. That's bad. It's not ever, never a joke, guys. But it's gonna be the Lucia of Silver Cobalt tossing out a few shots here and there. Blue Squad though all over the points so far. The Tracer are getting a quick little hammer pick as well. And now gonna dive into Saito. The Mercy getting caught left behind. Can Saito actually make it? There's gonna be the right click right now. Timora almost catches the Mercy. Finally, the Blue Squad with a kill on the two. Very, very skitterish. Duo, it, to say the least, least, it was interesting that one kill is, is good. That is, that is, that is solid. So Redux right now gonna be on the McCree. Looking for a shot or two. Mimu gets a little snipe and Redux with a kill on to one. Teleporter is there. Flashbang now connects. Redux looking for another target. Tomorrow just gonna float away instead. And the red squad just gonna dive in. Dinks right now looking for a shot on to Chiyaki. Timora out in front as well. KS Cruiser though with the kill on to Tomorrow. The red squad gonna go for the push as much as they can. Mimu almost ready with the photon barrier. It's gonna be Rayla as well with the Nano Boost in just a bit. So now gonna be Silver Cobalt Nano Boosted up. Is this actually the real strategy here from the Blue Squad to keep the Lucia topped up, to keep the Lucia in the strongest condition as they can? 100% right now here for the Blue Squad. Tomorrow the win pick up and it's gonna be a sound barrier right now. In the meantime, Redux up on top, going for a dead die there. On to Mimi, Mimu. Graviton Surge is there as well from Chiaki. Post from connects onto Super Cobalt, however, and the Lucia falls in that vein so now the red squad here just trying to flip this back Chiyaki trying his best to stay alive but two have fallen already and the coalescence comes out from Hanguk as well Photon Barrier cutting through the middle for the time being and the charge connects Fire Falcon with a pick up on to two the Reinhardt bringing it back for the time being <laughs> so more I stop AF you're, you're totally winning though and now the blue squad getting the boop there on to Chaos Cruiser putting the Reaper to, on to his place the red team is struggling actually and the blue team has been absolutely solid fire falcon getting a quick little punch to the face and looks like the blue squad might be able to take this <laughs> has been absolutely impressive so far it's gonna be Saita right now working on it but yeah the red team just a little done a little done getting slaughtered right there oh that was right oh my You guys got boop. Why do you guys get boop like that? Oh. 
I'll do, I'll do a shuffle real quick. What, you guys, what is happening, guys? What happened in that game? Yeah, it's just one of those games where it just goes. This is Lucio tomorrow on the Reaper. And if he thinks on the Ana, Fire Falcon on the Reinhardt, and Rayla on the May. On the other hand, it's Redux right now. When you're running the Widowmaker, Lev on the uh, Hamster, Dumbledore on the Soldier 76, Papa Prince on the Mercy, Chaos Cruiser on the Border, and Calamitous on the Genji. For now, the red squad just gonna try and go for the climb, but no, the mage is trying to freeze everyone up, even slowing down my speech. Papa Prince, though, does get picked off, and Calamitous with the pick down on the silver thank cover right you, now. Thank you for the. Thanks for the reset. Dude, are we six months? Dude, half a year, man. Half a year of bullshit together. Half a year of scrims and bullshit so thank you thank you to Saito for the resub Calamity so with a pick up on the two and he already has the dragon blade gonna go for a cut on to absolutely nothing the blue squad right now no this Calamity is waiting for Rayla to come out just waiting for the mate to show up in front of the Genji and now the shirk is being tossed and this is really bad here for Calamity he doesn't have the swift strike to get away hops on top of the electrical board and Chiaki does get the kill but here comes the res now from Papu Prince putting Calamity back into harm's way gonna go for the swift strike oh the deflect doesn't connect does die instead to the hand of the mate and now the and now the Nano Boost right now is available. He's one of the squad. The mines are being placed there by the left, just isolating the blue team away. The, the payload right now is just trying to struggle. Here. A little bit of pick off, however, on to Dumbledore. Fire Falcon links with, with two ultimates so far. Fire Strike connects. And now Rayla with the kill all to two, going for a few swings as much as he can. Left right now, putting up the shields. And it, now the Blizzard comes out in front of the spawn. So. The red team just caught outside. Redux getting a pick off there onto the main. Just getting rid of all the ice wall shenanigans. And now that the kills are from Calamitous in the back line, he does get traded and the coalescence will be coming out. The Earth Shatter is cancelled by his death. And now a tactical visor comes out. Dumbledore with a kill onto two. The red squad right now just gonna go for the push tomorrow. Raid form out in the back line, but will fall instead to the hand of the Genji. So for now, the red team will try to reset gonna just push with the payload they don't really have anyone to anchor onto the payload so it's gonna be chaos cruiser instead it'll be the moira cannot can't actually go for the healing as much as she'd want to because the close the moira has close range healing fire falcon gets nano boosted up gonna go for the push here just moving around that ball like a you know, like a ball, just kicking it around. Dragon Blade comes out though from Kalam. The Sandbarer is popped in response. Lynx does get the pick off onto Kalam, and the Blue Squad is able to hold on to this by the Westworld area. Getting kill on to five. I'm gonna charge in Silver Cobra right now, using that Sandbarer in that fight to keep everyone topped up. And Lynx has the heal, get, needs to get healed up. Silver Cobra though, all the way in the front. But why is this just keeping it up? Okay. So now the Ana is a little sad, does not have any way to actually heal up herself. The uh, Reflect once again is way too late there from Calamitous. Fire Falcon able to get the shutdown. Blue Squad gonna go for the push. Pablo Prince are going for the heals and Chaos Cruiser is the one getting topped up instead. Redux out in the sky, wanting to go for a snipe onto the, the Farah of Simora. Tomorrow though, just booping around the Wrecking Ball, who's just rolling around in, in Westworld. He's like the Tumbleweed weed in all those Western movies. Redux though does get a pick up on the Chiaki. Silver Cobble does return the favor, and the red team and the blue team are even for the time being. Now the boost comes out right now. Timora is glowing, gonna charge into Dumbledore and Case Cruiser. Redux does get the snipe out instead, and the shatter from Fire Falcon is rendered ineffective. Oh, Diggs with a kill onto two. Liana right now getting. Lev and Calamitous wants to go for Papa Prince as well thanks to the speed boost. The blue squad able to hold on this and this Ana right now has been absolutely on fire. Gonna go for the snipe. Chiaki gonna get the right click instead. And the blue team just holding on by the middle area. Two kills, go two kills going the way of Dinks right there. Uh, it was actually impressive. Uh, the Sugat is not affecting my aim. Oh man, teach me how to lose. You got this dude. Oh my god. Was that another shutdown there from Dinks? 
Missy Pavel Axe, Missy Two Punch, Nice and Gamba. This is a shutdown there from Things has been absolutely on point. We've been practicing so far. The, we have the tactic visor, however. And Dumbledore with the kill on to one. Dumbledore with the kill on to two as well. Redux getting another pick, and the red team gonna go for the push. Fire Falcon gonna back off for the time being. It'll be the red team though, working on the backline once again. Lev just rolling around once again. Papa Prince is able to get the kill. Hey, Puna, you're right here. Papa Prince is just playing the battle. Mercy gonna back off for the time being. Silver Cobalt though, just just trying to sing to his cards in bed. Chaos Cruiser is able to get a pick up, pick up onto one. Redux will get the kill as well. And Redux now with the second kill so far. This Widowmaker here onto the side just doing enough damage there to whittle down the oncoming defense. And it's gonna be Dumbledore and Redux both dropping down right now. Wants to regroup onto the payload. Payload now being captured and the second checkpoint is has been taken so no the red team gonna go My for the push <laughs> like a lab has been absolutely struggling today to to say the least he he hasn't been playing as good as he gets but the blue team gonna go for the push once again the sleep dart is available the graviton surge comes out Yaki getting three so far power prince and dumbledore both to fall to the hammer the blue squad gonna regroup here by the UFO and the red team just being forced back into spawn. Battle of Mercies are being abound right now. And look at this, Rayla just gonna go for the heal on to Chiyaki so far. Bio Orb right now being tossed out. And we have left once again on the Wrecking Ball. Minefield is available in just a bit. Gonna go for the swing. Chiyaki though out in front, just trying to whittle them down. The red squad gonna go for the push, and it's gonna be the mines being placed. Redux with a pick up on one. The sandbar is available. And tomorrow we'll go for the rocket punch on the backline. Getting rid of only the mines, only kills, kills on to Redux and now Dumbledore. Tactic Pfizer cops out, gonna go for the auto aim. Looking around, does get a few shots here and there, but Fire Falcon is the one who gets shattered instead. Putting the soldier 7 6 onto the floor. Tomorrow, just hovering around, wants to go for a shot or two, gets a kill on to Lev. The blue team though, getting those kills. Here comes Calamitous once again, the Dragoblade is available. And Calamitous right now, looking at her, Love just wants to get a swing of things. Dragoblade all the way at the end, and will get punished by Fire Falcon accordingly. You don't want to use your ultimate like that, very very questionable play there from Calamitous. Just a little too greedy to chase after that mercy. So the blue team doing the tried and tested spam at the spawn and hopefully get a kill. On the other hand, Redux playing very smart, gonna flank and gets up on top, gets a good sideline there onto the over advanced blue squad. Calamitous in the back line, just looking for the mercy once again. Whip pistol is whipped out and Calamitous has no form of self healing for himself. Hasn't he get healed up by his teammates instead? One for one trade so far between the two teams. Redux right now looking for a target or two. Gonna be Fire Falcon ready with a shatter, slams it onto the ground, gets absolutely nothing. Levdo real low out in to with the flying saucers, just trying to fly himself. Steve are connects and here comes the pin from Fire Falcon. Putting the Winston in his place. Two kills going the way of the blue team so far. The red team does trade back as well. Can the red squad actually hold on to this? As Redux going for the snipe. Gonna advance in the tracer right now. And Silver Cobalt falls to the hands of the Widowmaker. Chiaki though turning it around. Will have the gravity surge in play. Uses it on the Redux. And now the tanks just keeping the point in their possession the payload just having the footmarks of the Reinhardt and the Zarya that's gonna put a dent there onto the limousine and we have the Valkyrie right now from Rayla just going for the Bow Mercy Calamitous Dragonblade once again but now he's really really low Soundbarrier is there from Silver Cobalt really is able to get the kill onto the Genji Rocket Brunch will be the nail in the coffin here tomorrow I'm just making it rain onto the point and tut tut it looks like it's gonna be the blue team holding the defense and stop won't stop <laughs> Switching sides. Solo dive god. <laughs> this calamitous just well very very questionable by the way. But it is what it is. Dax does it notify you if it I sub to you? It should. It really should. Cause Saito gave just resubbed a while ago and I know. And yeah, you know. DPS players. Actually, I think the whole red team is a DP is our DPS players. Like in this whole scrim, eight, not eight people here are DPS players. On the other hand, the blue team has two, two, two. 
four. <laughs> so yeah, it's just we're a very very DPS heavy scrim today, but it, ha it happens. You can't segregate people by role. That's not really fair. And you know, I can't not let people play because they're not playing the role. You know, it was it is what it is, guys. And sometimes it's not like life. Now though, the red team gonna be running a McCree from Redux, Levon, the Zarya, Papa Prince on the Mercy, Chaos Cruiser on the Moira, Calamitous on the Genji, and Dumbledore. Probably gonna go for the Ryan. Probably gonna go for the Wrecking Ball, maybe. Sorry, sorry, sorry. What are you doing? The red. We'll see what the red team's gonna be up to. On the other hand, it's gonna be Chiaki on the Zarya, Silver Cobalt on the Lucia, Timora on the Pharaoh, Dinks on the Yana, Farfakan running the Ryan, and Rayla on the Maze. So as we're saying, you see the Wrecking Ball here from the Baldor. Just a very, very fun hero to play and is very effective, honestly. If you know how to use him right, if you know how to cause the chaos. And your main job is to just be such a big distraction to force people to pay attention to you instead of your team. And that's how you play the Wrecking Ball really, really well. Getting into the slam right now. Oh, doesn't put up the shield! That was very unfortunate there because he gets charged up before putting up those shields. He would have survived there. The Red Squad does get a pick up onto two so far. Gonna be Lev right now being the main tank that he really is apparently. The main Ice Wall is being flopped up. And now the Genji just jumping around. Sleep Dark connects once again from Dings on to Calamitous. So we see a charge and Ice Wall comes out now from Rayla to try and trap the Zarya and the Genji. Lev falls like a hero. Speed boost is there so far from Silver Cobalt. And the Blue Squad gonna go all the way in with that speed boost. Calamitous able to get a pick up onto one, however. Fire Strike getting reflected as well. That's my little charge going the way of the Genji so far. But in the meantime, it's Dings who gets picked up by Redux. The glowing Fire Falcon though will fall instead to the hand of Chaos Cruiser. Rayla shows up behind Redux. Oh, the combat roll at the end. So Rayla doesn't get the kill there. On to Redux, the Dead Eye is available. Perfect reaction play there coming out from Redux. And the Red Squad right now has four ultimates in their defense. On the other hand, the blue team gonna switch it up, gonna go for the Brigitte instead. It has Lucio and Diana. Will we see a third switch onto a tap? Will we see some goats here from uh, Timora? Valkyrie though has to pop and it's gonna be a grab the surge to start things off. Things falls already. Redux in the back line. Gonna go for the dead eye. Calamus with the blade as well. And now Flurry of Ultimates there from the red squad to hold on to this. The Dragon Blade gets three. The dead eye gets two. And that's gonna be a team kill. And that was absolutely impressive. Let's watch that again. I wanna see that how that worked out. So the Graviton Surge being plopped by the blue team, but the red team committing the mines just to boop people around and the Dragon Blade all the way in the back line. Redux with the kill onto the Calamity with the kill onto the tree, and that is a uh, solid, solid play there. The space being made by the tanks, they were the ones who got grabbed anyway. And the fact that the McCree wasn't Graviton Surged in was very, very vital to the red squad's defense but now they're losing out they lo used all their ultimates in that fight and the blue team just gonna charge in with the speed boost taking care of absolutely everyone Shiaki takes down Redux as well Papa Prince in the corner gets <laughs> doesn't even bother to do anything at all my ultimate is charging. So blue team right now 350 in the time bank. They have several cobalt and two more already with their ultimates. We might see a sandbuyer working together with the dragon blade. On the other hand, Dumbledore just floating around as much as he can. Tomorrow jumping up as well. Graven Surge now comes out. And there is gonna be a coalescence tomorrow. So let's get a pick up and Dragon Blade now is out in the back. Chaos Razor gets taken down. The blue squad right now gonna dash in once again. Redux really really low. Because we uh well nope, the deflect doesn't connect onto the flash bomb. So the nano boost is available here for Redux. So real question is, I for Dinks rather. Real question is who is actually gonna use it on? I wanna see maybe a boost show, maybe a boost pre detail would be cool too. But Chiaki right now working on that Graviton, able to work to kill Papa Prince already. Dumbledore out in the sky, the fire right, just trying to cause a lot of pressure from the airline level. Might be the red squad though. Jumping up in front, Dinks puts up the fire grenade. The red team 
is working together to try and make this work. Gonna be a grab in the search right now from Chiyaki. Papa Prince falls already. The Wrecking Ball just tried to escape away tomorrow with the kill. On the one, there's gonna be a stun. Redux go ball through the hand of the Genji. So the blue team will be able to get the capture. Dragon Blade out of desperation. No, it's gonna be a advancing turn. Dragon Blade here from Calamitous. He gets a kill onto one, but thinks he's gonna be just spawning right there. Not really the best time so far. Okay. So that does not come out, and it's gonna be the red team close to the end. Can they actually finish this up? The blue team will bring it back. It's a kill on to four. Can the attack just go all the way to the point? And that's gonna be the blue team taking the win. A very solid push in at the end takes it. The dragon blade just went way too ineffective. Play of the game. I like this. I like this play. I like this play a lot. This was absolutely solid from both Redux and Slam. So maybe I'll just give it to them. That was a perfect symphony from the two. And I like seeing Redux and Arya. Redux on the Widowmaker and Rayla on the Mercy. On the other hand, Fire Falcon gonna be on the Reinhardt. Lev on the Zara. Oh, Super Goblin gets killed already. <laughs> <laughs> Tanga. Exactly. That is exactly what you have to say to someone like that. Dumbledore on the Tracer. That's a GM Widow Genji main, by the way. Fondrick on the Zenyatta. Next round, the Mercy and Calamdo seems will be on the Widowmaker. The red team gonna go hop up on top. Really going for the hide. That was actually really smart there from Rayla. And Redox wins it out. Once again, Redux has been on point on taking their care of Calamitous all freaking game. Dinks is on the Zarya right now though. Take, getting rid of Fire Falcon. The blue squad gonna go for the push. It could be left getting destroyed there by Dinks. And for now, it's the, it's the red team. I, I'm actually surprised that Lev is still playing the off tank compared to Dom or compared to Halak. Who need to practice their off tank. <coughs> I don't even know anymore. On the other hand, it's gonna be Chiyaki out in front. The red team just working on this score is up. The fire strike connects this time. And now the red squad just waiting for the advance. Oh left going for the Oh no, that's I, I don't think he can do that. I don't know if he can do that with low energy. If that even matters or he just did it wrong. In the meantime, it's gonna be the Ana of tomorrow going for a few snipes all the way at the corner. Really good position there from the Ana. And that's what makes Ana a really good pick here on top of a newest point. Hey, Chiaki though goes for the slam, gets a kill on to one so far. Left with game brought back up to life, however, and finally foul back and falls to the hand of Dix. The blue squad gonna advance into the red team once again. Double door right now. Close to the close bomb, but gets taken care of by Chiaki instead. So for now, the blue team actually has been impressive on their hold, and they have the fair and balanced reptile. Look what for Silver Couple is actually putting himself on. Gonna drop down. Gonna go for a few swings here and there. And what does he swings? I mean, tossing a few grenades here and there. <laughs> Trying to get back up, but he's gonna fail. That Redux did another pick off on to Calamitous. There's gonna be the Reds, and Redux. Oh, the super jump. I don't even know how to do the super jump actually. Redux gets a pick up on the next on the fun trick as well. What is this guy? Why is this guy not in any part of any stable team? What an amazing shot there from Redux. Oh, he gets a kill on Firefax as well. Oh wait, he's part of an international one! Double alert though, taking care of Redux right now. Wants to go for the post bomb and don't do dumb. Dumb what happened, my friend. Why'd you stand still like that? Gets, gets shot in the face, however, by the Widowmaker. Five ultimates ready here for the blue squad. The red team does have two. And coming up with up five as well. But now the blue team might be able to get the initial initial jump on the red team. It all depends on how they're going to play this. Graviton Surge and the post bomb can be a very, very potent combo. And for sight now comes out here from both Widowmaker. It's going to be Chiyaki out in front once again. Just trying to protect things, trying to protect Tamora. But the one in the sidelines there. Fast three now popped by Nixer. And there's going to be a Graviton Surge from Dix as well as Lev. So both squads committing their Graviton. Two for two trades so far. Dumbledore getting those kills. Dix though, Nana Boost. It's not going to be Dix, Nana It's Chiyaki, Nana Booster. But high energy there for the Zarya. Transcendence a little too late there for Funchek to keep the red team alive. And now the Zenyatta in a bad spot. Gets taken care of by Dix. The red team though. 
Going for the contest. Who is actually there? It's Dumbledore right now. On to the point. Just blinking around. <laughs> Being very, very cheeky. Gets a swift hammer to the face. Lev, on the other hand, will take care of things. And now the Wrecking Ball just floating around trying his best to stay on to this fight redox is going to be the target the little maker is trying to stay alive oh the shadow comes out there from shiaki for the time being redox and tomorrow with a kill on to two so far on the other hand 10 seconds remaining here for the red team to actually advance on to this attack and they actually make it back onto the point can them get back there no it's gonna be the red team right now not not having the opportunity to do so Unfortunate to say the least. Score zero to zero. Switching size. Uh, we have the classic two CP. I'm gonna hold you to this part, and you guys are gonna stay there. So sad, sad lah for for the red team. Could have actually gotten the push in if they actually got on to tomorrow here. If they went to the right side, forcing the Ana off, they would have. A better chance and if calamitous actually won the fight against redux they would have had a better chance but redux has been so on fire today honestly i'm not even the i'm not putting this as a knock on calamitous in the first place redux has been absolutely impressive today with his aim he has been so so on point and shows why he is a force to be reckoned with on that window maker on the mccree on most of those hit scan heroes there you go redux i suck your i suck your ep already fuck you <coughs> Bernardo will see a Reinhardt and a Diva combination between Farfakken and Lev. Oh, this is the Nano, the Nano Cola. Uh, mech. That's cool. It has a, it has a thing. Oh, it's a soda. <laughs> it's a soda whole dispenser thing. That'll be Farfakken. We'll be playing the Ryan Lev on the Diva, Funchuk on the Lucio, Nexer on the Mercy, Calamitous on with the Maker, and Dumbledore right now. Gonna be playing the Soldier 76 on the other hand. Shiaki's on the Diva, Silver Cobalt on the Trunkrat, Tomorrow on the Ana, Dinks on the Zarya, Redux on the Widowmaker, and Rayla on the Mercy. We have Stream Sniper. Yeah, good job, guys. Mm. I just see you on real quick. Now the blue team will just advance in once again. Chiyaki right now, just putting up the shield, not allowing the calamity staff to get a pick or two. For now, the red team just staying on this. Gonna be a far strike. We toss that, and here comes the duel once again between Calam and Redux. Yes, I mean, the pressure is on already to Calamitous. Well, I will alleviate it. Gonna go on to the with the maker instead with the diva. Just trying to be a distraction. And now will fly off into the tank line, putting up the defense radius, but this is very dangerous here for Diva. Needs to get healed up quite quite quickly here by Nixer before he can get back into the fight. Calamitous gets a pick up onto Dix right now. The red is coming out from Rayla, putting Dix back into the fight. The Mercy putting the damage boost as well. Patrick just skating around with the Lucio, keeping everyone topped up. Here comes Shiaki, however, into the fight. Charge comes out. Fire Falcon does get punched. And now Calamitous onto the floor. Charge doesn't connect, but this should be the kill there from Shiaki. No because it even leads to that factory now from Nixon to keep the red team topped up in this fight. Calamitous though gets a quick little buy grenade and will fall to the hand of Timora instead. Guys comes out right now and here we have the Riptar from Super Cobalt. Oh, it gets shut down by the group of all things. The red team holding on to this so far with a very, very surprise in a very surprising way. But Fire Falcon gets blown up as he gets moved on to the Reinhardt. Sapphire is available and the Lucio keeping everyone alive here in this fight. Dumbledore with the Doomfist gets a punch there on to Dinks. A Doofus pick right now, one without a desperation to be honest, but the blue squad just keeping on, the, the trap is out in front and the Riptar now is available, we have the grab and surge here from things to put the Lucio in his place, and then Anna boost is there, self shock will be enough, oh it doesn't get any kills, and the blue team having to deal with the diva for the last moment, the are way too far in this fight, Firefox is the only one left now for the red squad, putting up the shield, but everyone advancing again. The blue team will take it, but not without difficulty. Not without difficulty. Play of the game. This is not your time. Yeah, 
next sleep. <laughs> Why is there three cards? What was up? What was up? What was up? What was up? Five, four, three, okay, two, si Matt sa one, MMK. Round one. Ah, um... <laughs> no comments. No comment, dude. I am a gun. Okay, Lev's gonna be on the tracer here. Tosino on the Ana. Oh, no. Tosino. Tosino, are you okay? Okay, Tosino's fine. So anyway, we can go back into our game. Everyone's gonna deal duel by the jump pad. It's gonna be a jump in, however, from Chaos Cruiser. Matt Javelin taking a nap. Silver Cobalt right now will get the kill, and the blue team will just advance in. So for now, the red squad just trying to stay on this. Oh, the Hulk almost connects there. Auto Kilau is putting the Widowmaker back in his place. Sweet Fry, on the other hand, gets a kill onto the scene. The red team gonna run rampant already. And it's gonna be the second, the first stick taken here. And the first capture for the red squad so far. KS Cruiser just causing chaos as much as he can. Jumping around and onto the map. The blue team though staying alive here up on top. Silver Cobalt with this Arisa. Uh, was fortified well to say the least but he he just got, got taken out care of and redox did die as well so no one worth protecting in that area for the arisa sweet fry right now taking care of left once again and you never want to play a tracer against sweet fry he's gonna run that brigitte and he's gonna make your life absolutely miserable to say the least so maybe a fire here from the blue squad will be a lot better but calamitas is already on point Gets the thing there on to Timora. Oh, Redux with the cannon kill and the Dragon Strike now is available. Timora switching to the Fire up. Exactly what is needed. Nyx though will pick up now onto the scene. Though. And we have a battle for Nyxer this time. Sweet Fry will pop the rally as well. And Nyxer gonna play very aggressively. Takes care of Redux already. The Tracer is now really low. Almost falling. Timora up in the sky. Exactly what they need. But Nyxer is an absolute beast with that pistol. Gets a kill on to three so far. The red team right now with 56% on this thing. BG's fam, palpa, lamon, nanao sa wow. That's what you've been doing. That's what you've been doing all all day, plus plus. Basta, basta you're having fun, man. Basta you're having fun. In the meantime, the red team right now 75% in counting. I can count like. Around Let's get to that anyway, so sorry about that. The red team right now is 86%. Gonna be a grapple search from Chiaki right now to keep the red team bunched in. Match Haven gets the mech, and we have the nano boost. So the blue team trying to turn this around with their tank play. And this is absolutely impressive here from the blue squad. They're able to turn it around with that grapple on the search. Nixer falls to the hand of Silver Cobalt. Thanks, switching to the tracer, but instead might want to switch back. Oh, dot dot dot. Matt throw. What did Matt do? I just literally out tab for half a second to reply to something and Matt did something. Okay. Matt, what you doing, dude? Now 15% here for the blue team. Is Super Cobalt gonna hide in the corner instead? Timor just floating around. 20% so far here for the time being. Calamitous versus tomorrow right now. Nixon with a pickoff. And now the pistol is out and about. The Zuna getting a few shots. Gonna be a drop down from Diana. So the blue squad trying to turn this around. But Chaos Cruiser able to shut Diana down. So no real healing here for the blue team so far. No one on the point besides Redux. And the McCree is not a lone ranger type of guy. Oh, he gets a kill on Calamitous. But that is gonna be the Valiant aid here for Redux. The rally comes out and Sweep right now out in front. Gonna go for a smash there on to Timora. The Rocket Barge is available. Good drop down from the Fire so far to keep the contest alive. And now the Rocket Barge is available. The bubble is used. Chiaki using the bubble a little too early to see the getting the snipes, however. And now Timora gonna go for the last ditch effort with the Rocket Barrage. Makes a train on to Matt Chavin. Wants to go for Chaos Cruiser next, but Calamitous and Nixer get the snipe together. Nixer with the Valkyrie, taking care of absolutely everyone on the blue squad. Chiaki though, turning it around with a pick up onto the two supports so far. So no healing here for the red team. KS Cruiser does get a pick up onto Lev with the primal range, putting the Zenyatta to the corner. But Redux will be able to tame the caged animal. And the blue team able to bring it back. Uh, I am Pero, you know. Weird timeline pa. The, the My ultimate is almost ready. 
This is a very important My conversation, ultimate. guys. So it's gonna be a gravity search ability if you for Chia. He's gonna pop it onto Sweet Fry. The, the shield way too small. And Kobe there from Tosino does get to gonna be a barrier there from the blue squad and the red team faltering at the last moment. Just the tide shifting so heavily in the blue squad the moment Matt literally choked the gravity search, I believe. Everyone just had to stop. Uh now in the horizon also. So now the blue team. Just keeping this up, Redux and Tessino ready to come up with the Nano Dead Eye. Silver Cobalt has the Supercharger in just a bit as well. That would be a very, very strong uh, Dead Eye to say the least. Calavas though does get a pick off on Tessino. And that is a very so solid pick here from the Red Squad. self the shop now coming out from Matt gets absolutely nothing. The Red Team though getting the kills. Three have fallen right now. It's a, they take care of Silver Cobalt as well. And that pick off from Calavitas opening up the Red Team for... The capture of the point. Just take any rid of Diana. Could be on gardens next. I do apologize for a little quiet in this one, guys. Like, like, and just have to work on something real quick. It's like emergency stuff. That was that was the peak, honestly. Back. Anyway, so let's go back into the game. Back to our scrim. Sorry about that, guys. There'll be tomorrow, though, down below. With the Farah on the ground. Not really the most common thing you'll see unless you see the Sombra going for the hack. Calamitous. Oh, okay, that's gonna be a trade. Uh, awkward. A little awkward right there, but the blue team ready. Winning the numbers game, but thanks. And she fried turning it back around. So the people on to the point here for the red squad, and they get to take it. Those last minute kills on to Chiaki and on to Lev has been absolutely solid so far. The red squad right now working on their progress here. Sui Fry just holding up that shield. Waiting for an opportunity. Silver Cobalt gonna just charge in instead with some health there from Chiaki. But C Fry already third person camera does get the stun there. Redux going for a few more pot shots here and there. So Cobalt gonna go for a dash in. Gonna be a stun from C Fry from the time being. The red squad right now just keeping this up. Tomorrow, Silver Cobalt though with a pick off on to two. Next turn floating around once again. It's gonna be Mercy falling. The blue team just having to go for their advance and they take care of Matt Javin as well. Calamitous stands at the point and just dies. He literally stands at the point and he's like, oh, please kill me. And the blue team is more than happy to oblige. More and right now, ready with two ultimates. On the other hand, the red squad will have the rally in their arsenal. Some right clicks being tossed out by Chiyaki for the time being. Tomorrow ready to just hop up on top and go for the, her, his father then. Uh, Rocket Barrage. Gonna go back to the back line. And this looks like it's gonna be absolutely terrible here for someone from the red squad. And oh, okay. Uh, a little awkward. I was overhyping that. And Tamora knows she screwed up. Amy, Tamora, are you listening too much to me? Relax, you got that, but you got the Derek there on to Nixer. The bubble was there from Matt Javelin, giving him some energy, but grabbing the surge way too far, blows himself up instead. Gonna be the blue team right now holding on to this. The dead eye available for Redux to go for the zoning tool. Gonna be the blue squad though holding on to this. Thanks, Recall takes care of the Farah, but that's not gonna be that's not gonna be enough. The red team right now has to regroup has to fix up their strategy honestly they have winston and they have, they have a zarya not really the most common pairing but you know it's it's okay it's an okay pairing you bubble the winston and then he dies <laughs> i mean that's that happens to me oh nixer nixer getting charged out of nowhere silver couple with the kill on to two the earth shatter is available but the red team able to bring this back so far with calamus right now getting some kills there's gonna be a shatter there's gonna be a slam as well the blue team right now just taking care of the red squad all over calamus the only one who's actually gotten some kills in that engagement is the one who is so keep fighting fighting the good fight oh calamitous Calamitous able to clutch
rush it out. I don't know what else to say. The red team right now, bring it back in. Uh, um, the true potential there from Calamitous. I'm, I, I can't not give him the highlight there. He was on a lot of kills. Did he use the Dragon Blade? Now he has the Dragon Blade. He's gonna go for cleanup. Gets killed auto redux Timora. Super Cold Falls. Cena as well. Okay, I'm done. You get the highlight. I love you so much. Calamitous with team kill. <laughs> Okay, you're the highlight. I've seen worse. For sure. I've seen worse. <laughs> you, you did it. You, you freaking did it. You yeah, have impressed me. Okay. <laughs> uh, I'll give it to you, even though it's drag. It's like the whole thing, the whole chain there from Calamitous. I need to stop and just appreciate that. Timor that's getting taken down. Calamitous right now just going ham, ham once again. Grab the search is there. Casino will take down on to one. The red team though is keeping the up. Gonna be the tracer of He's gonna dive in. We have the rally from Sweet Fry right now. But Red Squad just keeping the push up. And will the blue team get back onto it? No, it's gonna the red team will win it. That is the point of this. So for the attack, gonna be Chaos Cruiser on the Uri, Funtrick on the Mercy, Dix on the Hanzo, Machavan on the Diva, Nixer on the Ana, and Calamitous on the Genji on the other hand. Farfak and gonna be playing the Reinhardt, Sweet Fry on the Mercy. Tomorrow, just skulking around with the Winston, Redux on the Hanzo, Super Combo, dead on the Junkrat, and here's the Cena on the Ana. So thank you for the follow right there from Passerby04. The blue squad right now getting a few more picks here and there. And their defense though, not really as effective as it could be for the time being. Then we jump in right now from Timora. Looking for an opportunity to go for the zaps. Nixer is the one being electrocuted. It's gonna be a jump out in the bubble. Oh, a really good bubble right there. Just keeping Tamora alive just with the 360 right there. So Super Cobalt is able to get the drip tire already. Gets rid of Chaos Cruiser. And that's gonna be the first. And that's gonna be the first hold here. Successful for the blue squad. There you go. Thank you for this. Your. There's your note to pride there. To see no Redux and Sweet Fry already ready with their ultimates, but it's gonna be an easy rest here from uh, Sweet Fry. Dragon Strike is tossed out by Dings though, as well as Redux. So twin dragons there are gonna make a lovely shade of purple for the time being. Have you guys ever seen a purple dragon besides Spyro? I want I wanna see that. Like if if the two dragons actually touch, one is blue, one is red, they should actually mix colors. Or something that'll be really cool, but maybe it'll be very confusing in terms of the game. Farfakan though, not making any confusion there. Match having gets picked off. Calamitous right now. Nana Blade is out and about, and he's a little awkward. Oh, okay, very awkward. Nana Blade right there from the red team. The scene of perfect sleep dart, no defense was available. Calamitous does stay alive, and Cena stays alive as well. Now here comes again, he tried to bully the Ana. By grenade comes out. Oh, sleep dart doesn't connect this time. But Timora with the prime rage put things to the corner. Wants to get rid of the mercy next to which he oh, okay. Timora, what are you doing? <laughs> is that a little taunt play there from Timora just standing there before jumping out? That was a little cheeky from the blue team so far. Sweet Fry though, just healing everyone up. Here comes the halt. And Timora and Farfax and just stay alive. Here's gonna be the self-destruct. Gets absolutely nothing. Oh Matt! Matt! What was that? Matt falls into the water. Ding switching to the Reaper. This is a smart pick right here. Because the blue team using that choke point to punish their uh, attacking team with impunity. Tomorrow chasing after Calamitous right now. But look at that. So much fusion cannon shots. And tomorrow gonna be in the gardens instead. Genji though. Just applying so much pressure. The Winston getting away, but finally Sweet Fry falls through the hand of Diggs. And Super Cobalt is ready with the Reptar Calamus is dashing his way to those kills. Getting two so far. And this might be a third one here for some. Oh, yeah, it's Calamus who really takes him down. Dragon Blade now is available, but Redux already falls through the hand of the Genji. Gonna be a charge back from Fire Falcon, but looks like the bank isn't gonna take anything. 
Really nice one. Oh, uh, Matt actually fell in the water right there after fa Fire Falcon. Solid charge right there from Fire Falcon. But now we have the Dragon Blade here from Calamitas. Gets rid of the two supports who do get staggered off. The Mortem does get a counter kill, but it's very, very dangerous right now for the Winston to stay there with the Reaper out in play. Oh, good snipe power. Sonic Arrow to the face of the Skull Mask. And now Redux has to contend with his niece, a little brother. And Fire Falcon gives him a quick little spam to the butt instead. And Nixer is on the Zenyatta this time, ready with the Transcendence already. The Red Squad right now gonna go for the push. It's gonna be Matt Chavin though being healed up his cruiser putting up the barrier as well so it's gonna be a pretty safe push so far here for the red team till the blue sun goes for the tent and gonna be a silver combo rips are transcendence isn't the best of best ult to try and counter that honestly if you have confidence in your aim and you you know where the rip tire is coming from i would i would highly advise against using the transcendence in the first place just go for the snipe on it i mean if you do die okay it happens could have used the trance there but at the same time if you get the shutdown no one dies in your team it's very 50 50. and speaking of 50 50 Dix had a 50 50 shot right there of the med pack being there now here comes the death blossom gets rid of two so far the Sino with the kill so the red team right now does have the small numbers advantage. Can they actually capitalize on it? Match having going for the hook. Gonna dive inside instead. And we have a Valkyrie now from front trick. The red squad just keeping us up with the Valkyrie push. But Timora able to get some punches on to Nixer. Kalan is holding on to that plane. Silver Cobalt with a shutdown on to K's Cruiser. Gonna be a jump in from the blue squad onto the Genji. And here comes the Valkyrie from Sweet Fry trying to get away from Kalamitas. But the Dragon Blade already takes care of too. The Swift Strike connects onto the Mercy, but it's not gonna be enough. You need the damage boost and you need the Discord Orb to actually make that count in the first place. Supercharger is available here for KS Cruiser and the Blue Squad all coming in once again. So Fire Falcon now glowing like the beast that he is. Gonna be a drop down so far. Here comes the charge. And now KS Cruiser putting up the supercharger. Dings will fall already to the hand of Silver Couple as well as Fire Falcon. The Red Squad gonna go for the push. Sweet Fry though onto the right hand side. He's gonna go for the fade away. Next up with the kill on to one. Transcendus is available here for the red team. And is now gonna be the second checkout being taken here by the by the MMK's practice <laughs> practice team, whatever it's called. Now on the floor and the blue squad will capitalize on the sleep dart already taking care of two they can actually defend this here at outright just get rid of Matt Chavin and now the road dog gonna go for take a breather the buyer getting the way of Tosino can't really go for the heal up here comes the buy grenade and it's gonna be Calamitous once again taking care of Diana, giving her another black eye but uh, you know when you're dead you don't really need those eyes in the first place thanks to the very very risky shadow step in the first place Timor was there could have gotten the hook and the kill Death Blossom is available right now for the Reaper. Gonna back off for the time being. Three ultimates ready here for the Red Squad. And the other hand, the blue team does have four. And Tosino close to the Nana boost, but no, not not quite so far. Fire Grenade comes out, and Nixer actually gets tagged there. The Calamus and Dings gonna dive in. Punch it with the kill. Death Blossom now comes out. Fire Falcon gets taken, torn apart. Redux will go for the Dragon Strike, but it's not gonna be enough. Nixer will fall. Tomorrow will get taken care of as well. Calamus is going for the wall jump and just trying to stay alive in this fight. The Wulha comes out there from tomorrow, pushing everyone back. And now the red team just charging in as fast as they can. And the Rod Squad can keep this up. Dragon Blade now comes out there from Calamitous. And he wants to go for the kill on to Sweet Fry already. Redux out in the field. The Hanzo trying to get away. Silver Cobalt though with a kill one. With a kill on to two. The Boots are going to go for the push. And Dings on the other hand with the snipe. The red team already going for the push in. It's going to be an extra though falling to the hand of Redux for the time being. Tomorrow going to be switching out. And the Blue Squad right now staying on this. Far Falcon out in front. Earth Shadow is available. Can go for the slam there. Can go for the hits. Nix is tossing it out. Match having ready with the whole hog as well. Nixer does have the chance to it. So the Red Quad should go for the reset right here if they don't have the opportunity to go for it. But on the other hand, the blue team losing members left and right. Finally bring it to back already. Redux and Tomar gonna go for the dive in. Hook comes out from Match Avin, gets a DMX so far. And now it's gonna be the Diva just trying to hop away. The tank line here for the red team, very very potent and very very efficient in terms of 
uh, HP values, but at the same time, they have the blue squad has Silver Cobalt in play. The Reaper can easily whittle them down. Kiss Cruiser not switching out, and the red team has three seconds to actually make it to the point. You're gonna go for the contest. And Galam is already with the D-Mech Fire Falcon. They're out in front, gets a pick up onto Dick's contract, and the soon pass them. We'll go for the rest instead. And now a Dead Blossom comes out. Silver Cobalt will get rid of Punchek so far. Just get sucked the life out of the Mercy so far. Meteor Strike now from Kalam is gonna land here. Redux doesn't get tagged. Gonna be the red team though with another pick off. And as I was saying, the red team will be able to take this for the time being. Score. Zero to three. Switching sides. Who are all these people? Who are all these random people? Nah, whatever. It is what it is. Hello. Solids. Solid, solid, solid. So, Rialto. The red team actually finishing out very very close actually could have gotten stopped by the first checkpoint but now the blue team will be running something cheeky. We'll see if this actually works out. It can be a Orisa Bastion. On the other hand, the red team gonna go for something a little more standard. We'll have the Widowmaker, we'll have the on as well. It's actually actually what they need against the Bastion in the first place. Other than a crippling addiction to peanut butter? What is that? Enough waiting around. <coughs> So the plaza will be the staging point here for the red team. Let me chaos cruiser though up on top. He's gonna try to stay up on this. <laughs> the Winston though, just you know, just just popping around as much as they can. And for now, the red team just 18 seconds remaining here for the blue squad's attack. What are they gonna be contending with? They will have the tracer and the widowmaker. So a little backline attack that have a little from way back of their own line attack that kind of thing mercy and on as well to go for the healing but the tracer will be very very dependent on those uh on what he calls on those health packs so it's gonna be very very dangerous right now for that tracer and it's gonna be super on the brigitte as well super cobalt gonna be on the bastion no way for in any environment kill so far for the red squad. Maybe we up the with a pick up on to Dinks. And the red team gonna call for the engagement already. Calamus with a pick up on to the McCree. But Silver Cobalt will trade it with a little, little rattle gun on to Chaos Cruiser. So you got now connecting. And the blue team just going for the push. Halt comes out. Fire grenade on to Matt Javelin. Where is Calamus actually set up? Trying to go for a smooth and silk shot, but not gonna work out. Dinks are gonna drop down. Going for the fire grenade. Literally runs past everyone. No one. Everyone ignores the honor for some reason and the contest is still there it's finally match Javin falling and the red team running around like chickens losing their heads the the silver cobalt bastion experience is gonna be coming their way here on to rialto and the plaza is gonna be riddled with bullets right now coming up from the bastion case cruiser look at him he's just using the planter as a cover point case cruiser though will fall quite easily things versus redux right now but the fire support from the bastion putting the tracer in such an awkward spot Punch it, going for the rest right now on to Calamitous. No, the sleep dart there. The next thing on to Silver Cobalt and Match Haven switching to the Roadhog. This is actually a very smart pick. He can take care of the Bastion and the Sweep and the Brigitte quite handily. The blue team has to regroup. And oh, the hook. Oh, the whip shot though, connecting from Sweep Prior right now. And now Match Haven has to back off to Sino. He's gonna come back to go for the heals on to the Redux Mixer. Perfect sleep dart there on to the Brigitte so far. And now the Bastion has fallen. Things with the take care, taking care of the nuts and bolts. The Red Squad though losing their Ana in, in the meantime and no has lost their I Mercy as well. The, the blue team finishing- oh what? What? Okay! Uh, I missed that. Uh, I was catching my eye but the blue team was able to get the first checkpoint already. Supercharger now is available. So we fight tomorrow and Fire Falcon ready in your ult. Redux as well gonna go for the Infracite in just a bit. Putting up that shield and the Bastion gonna go for a wild ride once again. Calamus though does get a pick off onto Ticino for the time being. The be a supercharger right now from Fire Falcon. The be also a sniper battle onto the second floor for the time being. The rally is available here. Nixodon does get a pick off and gets a sleep dart onto Silver Cobalt once again. 
again the bastion being shut down by diana has been the story of the show but it's not been enough it's just been a shutdown it hasn't been any kills nano boost right now on the things can he actually get pick up both bombs are next onto the floor doesn't get much three fry right now losing the sheet but will have the rally instead tomorrow graviton surge on to two calamitous and funcher get dragged into the fight and now Matt Chapman just poking around. He does get the hook there and does get the kill on to Redux for the time being. So the blue squad is going for the push as much as they can. The whole hog is available and Matt Chapman being put around is very, very far, that's for sure. Typical one Fire Falcon though with a pick off on to two. And now it's going to be Calamitous switching to the Doomfist, finally getting the skills. Calamitous with the Doomfist this time. A very, very impressive specimen on this hero and a very solid dive in, but gets sniped up after the stun coming out from the Brigitte. And Redux looking for the an opportunity to actually get some kills. Lynx has switched to the Bastion as well. Trying contending this, but it doesn't work out. Tomorrow with the kill onto the two. Or the Orisa of Chaos Cruiser wanting to advance in, but it's way too late right now for the fog four legged robot. Maybe the blue squad finishing the second checkpoint and look at that time bank they have right now. It's four minutes and twenty seconds as the blue team is being whittled down, however, by the red squad. But so far their push has not been staggered here on the second point. Gonna Gonna just go for the uncontested bridge area. Let me think so. Oh, the Graviton Surge from tomorrow right now takes care of two. Things are just standing there. No loose that this fight is pretty much over for for this fight. Yeah. This the blue squad going just has been absolutely solid so far. The more Antasino with another set of kills. Matt Javelin out in front, literally watching himself die as a bastion. Here comes the ship from the bastion. The Doomfist though gets caught out, gets taken down by Redux. <laughs> That's the invite now. The need to have my leave. Okay, just, just finish. Just finish, dude. The blue squad right now. Can they uh, actually make it? Sea Fry gets a quick low stun right there. Diana almost gets torn apart. And thank you for the follow there, Bonchon09. Can the red team actually keep this up? No, the blue team will be able to finish this. Well, we can give the win to blue. Time bound wise. If you guys gotta go. Okay. Switching sides.